Hey, welcome back to my channel. In this video, I'm gonna talk about top 5 best synthesizer keyboards. Starting at number 5. Modal Electronics 002. The first synth to come from the Modal Electronics stable, the 002 is a 12-voice hybrid synth. Incorporating high-resolution, numerically controlled oscillators, which promise greater stability. It comes with two oscillators per voice with two sub-oscillators, which can be switched from being either traditional square wave to having the same waveform as the main oscillator. In effect, making four oscillators per voice. The 002 features 24 dB per octave 4-pole transistor ladder filter, which is of an original modal design. The filter comes with some very unusual morphing characteristics or pole sweeping, enabling smooth transition from 4-pole through bandpass to 1-pole 6 dB per octave, or anywhere in between. A true evolution of the species, Modal Electronics Craft Synth 2. Zero draws on the raw synthesis power of the original CRAFTSYNTH, but adds a huge range of new features and again, raises the benchmark on what a compact, portable battery-powered synthesizer can do. Coming at number 4. Korg Prolog. On the sonic front, both the Prolog 8 and 16 deliver massively, and we found them very inspiring to work with. Despite some limitations. The character is definitely minilog-like at times, but bigger and bolder and the filter, with low cut, sounds great. With bags of personality. However, it also delivers huge bass and cutting, searing leads, classic FM sounds, warm fibrous pads and punchy synth brass. A testament to the versatile sound engine. Interestingly, the prologue fares best, not on those often overused classic VCO sounds, but instead on moody, hazy, textured epic atmospheres. With a little voice panning, along with the excellent reverbs, delays, and mod effects coupled with the vibey VCO and multi-oscillator. The sound palette moves into far more futuristic or contemporary territory. And that's where this synth really delivers, by the bucket load. Arpeggiat. 61 key. At number 3. Arturia Matrix Brute. There's also a lot on offer performance control-wise, besides the extremely powerful Matrix. Legato, Glide, Legato Glide, Mono, Duo Slash Split and 3-note paraphonic modes are also available. Yes, you can play standard leads, but also 3-note chords with envelope articulation, and the MB sounds great in this mode. You have 5 unique modulatable bucket brigade delay-based analog effects which sound wonderful blended with the VCOs. Mono Slash Stereo Delays, Chorus, Flanger and Reverb. 49-note keyboard with both velocity and aftertouch 100% analog signal path, with analog effects multiple keyboard modes for mono. Paraphonic and duo split modes unique matrix create your own routings built-in arpeggio and sequencer. Matrix Brute is perhaps the most powerful analog monophonic synthesizer ever. Number 2 of my list. Novation Summit. Summit has a lovely, 5-octave keybed which, in line with the rest of the hardware, feels premium. Notably, the black keys have a wider top surface than most and these feel great. Velocity and aftertouch response is spot on too. This is a very playable, precise, and nicely balanced synth action keybed. The chunky rubberized backlit mod slash pitch wheels also feel very premium and add lots to the overall expressivity of the synth. This synth is the best of the already great peaks, with double the polyphony. Three NCO new Oxford oscillators per voice, enabling subtractive, wavetable or FM synthesis. Analog multimode 12 24 dB filter per voice with dual mode. Five octave semi-weighted, premium keybed with velocity sensitivity and aftertouch, per part effects, distortion, chorus, delay, and reverb. Stereo audio in rootable to onboard effects and AUX outputs. Novation now offers a three-year warranty on this and all other Novation products. And number one. 
Moog Matriarch. Matriarch is a very elegantly designed self-contained synth. The nearest you can get to owning an expensive Moog modular, but at a fraction of the cost. It has a great feeling fader keyboard, audio rate modulation, intuitive sequencer and arpeggiator. Killer analog delay section, velocity and aftertouch and a very engaging soulful sound. The patch ability is also very well thought out and allows you to travel very deep, if you want. A truly inspired design and one that's very hard to stop playing slash exploring once you get your hands on it. Easily create rich harmonic shapes with up to four notes of paraphony that can be sequenced, shifted, and stored with Matriarch's intuitive 256-step sequencer. Or stack the analog VCOs to play on a massive four oscillator mono synth. With a deep assortment of synthesis modules based on Bob Moog's original circuit designs. Matriarch's 100% analog signal path spans a dynamic sonic vocabulary, from overdriven monophonic bass to gently evolving paraphonic plucks that cycle through wave shapes into a wash of infinite delay trails. Check out this video description for latest price and more informations. Thank you for watching this video. Please subscribe and stay tuned.